Welcome to my channel. We're going to learn how to import paper patterns into Clo in less than two minutes. Let's get started. First, download a scanning app to your phone. I use Microsoft Lens, but any app that allows you to warp a photo by individually adjusting each corner will work. Prep your paper patterns by pressing them flat and arranging them on a gridded mat, tiled floor, or other perfectly squared surface. It will help you later if you align the grain of your paper patterns with the side of your squared surface so that you don't need to rotate them later. Take your scan from directly above the paper patterns and then align the corners of the scan with the corners of the squared surface. Please note that if you're not careful with this step, your patterns will be distorted and will not import accurately. Measure the exterior edges of your squared surface for later. Transfer your scans to your computer. I save my scans to the gallery on my phone and then upload them to my Google Drive or email them to myself. To import your scans into Clo, select the rectangle tool or the S hotkey and click on the 2D window to draft a pattern with the dimensions of your squared surface. Add your scan as a graphic by selecting the graphic 2D pattern tool, double clicking the file on your computer, and then clicking on the pattern you just made to place it. For the height and width, type in the dimensions of your squared surface that you took earlier. You might need to uncheck the linked box if your square was not an actual square, but a rectangle, and then click OK. You can now move or rotate the scan with the transform graphic tool to align the grain line with the Y axis if you need to. Finally, choose the select move tool or the Q hotkey, click the pattern in the 3D window and press Control or Command J to deactivate the pattern and shift Q to hide the pattern in the 3D window. And that's it. The written guide for this tutorial is available on my Patreon. Thank you for your support.